that Johnson wore the Silver Star pin on the lapels of his suit jackets for the rest of his life. Cairo's book, Means of Ascent, takes umbrage at Johnson's receiving the medal for spending a few minutes under fire, but even that description overstates the case. The fact is, LBJ never got within sight of Japanese forces. His combat experience was a myth. Again, Tillman provides the following. Once back home, LBJ lost no time stumping the campaign trail. Cairo notes that Johnson had the Silver Star presented to him repeatedly, each occasion as if it was for the first time. Claiming the nickname Raider Johnson, LBJ also told audiences that he saw 14 Zeros shot down in flames. That never happened. The decoration remains a sore point with many of the 22nd Bomb Group veterans. The Hare's crew chief, retired Master Sergeant Woodrow W. Harrison said, as to the strangeness of LBJ's Silver Star, no other crew member aboard 1488 received one. 